The Mackinac Bridge, well known as the connection between the UP Upers and the downstate trolls. Head west on US 2 and you'll come across another iconic attraction, the Cut River Bridge. Listed on the National Registry of Historic Places, this bridge is so large that MDOT maintains it as an area attraction. This is a wonderful place to stand and take pictures of all the shades and the blue sky and the green leaves and the sun shining through on the bridge, which is also green. So it is extraordinary picture. It has a roadside park and a series of hiking trails around the bridge. With the fall colors of Mother Nature's paintbrush, there was no lack of visitors. No, we're here for colors. Just the tree colors. Where are you from? Raleigh, North Carolina. They came up and they went to Grand Traverse, and then they went to Meyer Gardens, then they were leaving. Isn't that something? From Texas. The Pure Michigan ads actually combat the other things that people hear about Michigan in the news, such as Flint water crisis in Detroit and the influx of the automotive industry. So it actually paints a better light for what we actually have with natural beauty. I come up here because of the lakes and the beautiful, um, right now it's peak season in northern Michigan. It is like no other in the United States. I mean, I have been to a few other states. I haven't seen it like I've seen it in northern Michigan. I would not want any of our advertising to be cut. Um, I don't think that's a good idea. I think we bring a lot of dollars to the state of Michigan, especially these areas in the north that get a lot of snow in the winter, and they depend on that summer traffic, and they depend on that fall traffic with the, the seasons. Um, their income is based on that, and we need to keep supporting those small uh, mom and pop type stores. Love the UP. Uh, my mother His mother was a UPer. Ellis White, second cameraman, and I found where the UPers accommodate visitors from downstate. Yep, it's autographed. The two main piers are joined by decorative stone arches and, of course, a beautiful view of Lake Michigan. I'm Dan Salas and this is PositivelyMichigan.net. <laughs>